struggling to improve business productivity while keeping your customers happy? If so, don't worry, because in this video, we'll break it down how ITSM and ITOM can help your business manage their IT services and operations. Hello everyone, welcome back. While both IT service management and IT operations management are part of IT management, they focus on different aspects of keeping IT systems running smoothly. But wait, before we dive in, if you haven't watched our previous videos on what is ServiceNow and its products, be sure to check out with the card above. Moving forward, what is ITSM and ITOM? IT service management focuses on delivering IT services to customers. For example, if your Wi-Fi goes down or you need some new software installed, you reach out to IT department, that's ITSM in action. It ensures IT services are delivered smoothly and efficiently. On the other hand, IT operation management handles the day-to-day -day tasks behind the scenes, like monitoring systems and keeping the infrastructure running. While IDSM is customer-facing, ITOM focuses on maintaining the tech foundation. They are used for different purposes, but there are a lot of similarities as well. So before we discuss the differences, let's check out their similarities first. So the first similarity is that they both play a crucial role in managing an organization's IT resources. Second, they both follow IT infrastructure library guidelines, which help align IT services and operations with business needs. Third, ITSM and ITOM both use well-structured service-oriented approach to ensure IT systems and services run smoothly. And last but not least, both prioritize security by implementing policies and procedures to protect IT systems and services from potential threats. Now let's explore the key differences between ServiceNow IDSM and ITOM. The first key difference is their focus. IDSM keeps customers happy by delivering reliable services, while ITOM minimizes downtime in IT department through better resources management and operational efficiency. Next, key difference is their working model. ITSM manages processes like incidents and changes. ITOM automates tasks and monitors systems to catch problems early. As far as their visibility is concerned, ITSM is outward facing and visible to all employees, while ITOM works behind the scenes to support the IT infrastructure. Another key difference is their service quality. IDSM ensures service quality meets organizational standards, while ITOM maintains the performance and availability of IT resources. Next key difference is a scope. The scope of IT service management is broad, encompassing all stages of the service lifecycle, while IT operations management has a narrower focus, concentrating specifically on the operational aspects of IT. The next key difference is primary users. ITSM systems include service desk staff, IT managers, and service delivery teams who focus on managing user requests and ensuring IT services align with organizational goals. In contrast, the key users of ITOM systems are IT operations team, system administrators, and network engineers who are responsible for maintaining the efficiency and reliability of the IT infrastructure to support business operations. And that's it for this video. In the next one, we'll cover new products from ServiceNow. So stay tuned. And if you are looking to upscale your business with ServiceNow, get in touch with our experts and we will make your journey seamless. All of the links to our blogs, case studies and e-guides are in the description below. So make sure you check that out. Thank you.